They got this, this, Mueller, this Mueller investigation. Yes. Eric, you yes. got anything? Any, he, any, no. I don't know too much about it because, you know. I want to say Monday. I ain't shit, but. They arrested. Mueller Monday. Mueller it's good day. Monday. It's a good yeah. Day. Mueller, um, people are Paul Manafort, <laughs> uh, the former campaign manager for Trump. I think him and Rick Gates were brought up on about 12 charges, ranging from money yeah. laundering to conspiracy against the country yep. to falsifying documents. They found Manafort with like three different passports. Bunch yeah, of different he was bank like accounts. Smuggling money. This nigga, this nigga was like a secret agent, son. This nigga was like James yes. Bond. It's insane <laughs> the had, amount of money he had he had stashed shit, away. You know what I'm saying? He was they said he was like buying mad clothes from random places. He spent like a million dollars at some rug store in this, in New York or some yes. shit like that. So Yes. It was crazy. from from what they said so far, a lot of it happened between like twenty eleven and twenty fourteen. So they don't they're not sure how much of it ties back to Trump. But back in the summertime, they arrested George Papadopoulos, who was Pops. Papadopoulos. Sorry, I couldn't. Killer. Sorry, I couldn't, even, I couldn't even. Chill, right, Please, my bad. please. Didn't mean to cut you off. George Gather pa- yourself, sir. Papadopoulos <laughs> got arrested back in the summer. He, yes. Uh, he was and he a, actually wore a wire. He was a foreign policy that. advisor. That they're saying it's possible he wore a wire. So who knows what was. Wore, wore a wire with Trump meet? With Trump whoever Trump he was or? meeting with because okay. they arrested him. Yes. They, he was try- I think he was trying to get out of here and they caught him at the airport. And uh, they're trying so, to. So they had actually said that. They have pictures of him right before certain meetings, like throughout the summer or whatever, where uh, he's supposedly wearing a wire. He's supposed you know what I mean? Like, and yep. they're trying to figure out who he was meeting with, where he was at. But I, I was laughing because right before Mueller Monday, um, they had stated that, I guess, you know, Trump got word of what was going on and he was like freaking out in the White House, like just going absolutely ape shit. He was enraged. He was nervous. And, you know, if, if you saw his tweets um, that week, he, he came out and he said, you know, there was no collusion. There was no yeah. this. There was no that. I think I'm convinced Trump tweets so much hoping we forget about what the tweet last oh, week yeah. said. I can't oh, keep yeah. up with Trump's tweets, man. That motherfucker. I mean, and, and, then, and then he tweeted, you know, we should be we should be focusing on Hillary and the crooked Democrats. Why? She's and not a like, president. She's not. Fucking Why president. are you still talking about Hillary, man? Because if you know. talk about her, you can't, you can't be focused on all the bullshit he's doing. And they asked her, she had a book signing randomly that week, and uh, somebody asked her at the book signing, you know, what do you think about Russia? Do you have anything to say? And, and she basically, like, she smiled, and she was like, there's a chapter on Russia in my book, and, like, kind of, you know. Read that shit, motherfucker. Yeah. Read my book, baby. <laughs> Read my book. But, um... I'm happy that they're finally bringing down indictments. I'm hoping that it's going to lead to something. Um, yeah, I'm not too. sure how much it's going to it's going to help. Like I've said before, if, if they can't clean house, I mean, they would have to pretty much wipe out everybody who's in the White House in order to get us somebody who's functional. So yeah, or I mean, it may be a slow process. It may it may take getting Trump out first and then working on that. But the thing other is, motherfucker. Pence has really been. Uh, kind of separating himself from Trump. I don't know if you've noticed, but he's really, really been in like the background throughout all this. And I think he's trying to keep his name clear because I feel like he knows at some point he's going to end up being president. And if Trump gets impeached, I think he's trying to kind of keep his nose clean, see if he can kind of, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And that's just a nightmare of a whole different color. How the, so. how the, how the chain of succession goes. Even if they got rid of everybody that's in the cabinet now, he'd still be left with like Paul Ryan, who's a whole a different type moron. of scumbag. A whole <laughs> yeah. different type of scumbag. So you're damned if you do, damned if He's you don't. A smart scumbag. That that makes it even worse because yeah, all yeah. the shit they're trying to get done now, yeah. I think he's smart enough, smart enough to get it done. Yeah. Especially all the shit he's learned in the past few few years as speaker of the speaker of the house now. 